<laughs> Hello, everyone. Dr. Kevin Zeta with Warrior Notes School Ministry, and this is our introduction to our new album from Dallas, live from Dallas. Yes. And we were talking about this get together, and actually, I was talking about managing your walk in the spirit and all the dimensions. And we we felt the anointing. We were talking about some of the things that the Lord was doing there. Um, I just I I I recall, and I listened to the music, and I really recall the Lord just working through all of us prophetically. It was almost like there was a healing flow there and you could feel it on the, on the, on the album. Um, a lot of these things, it's just like when you prophesy, you don't really remember. You have to almost ask somebody what you said. <laughs> yeah. And a, that, that is a good sign because I have to watch everything and, and find out what God was saying. I, I watch, watch the videos and I, I find out what God was saying through us. So it's the same thing with the album. So anyway, I, I felt like God was really healing people because um, we were talking about the influence of, of the different realms on your walk with God. So it was, a, it was a, a, I believe, the first time we were in Dallas and the anointing was was really strong and I, I believe that Satan tried to stop us I think it was almost two years at least yeah. maybe three years that he stopped us from getting into Dallas we couldn't find a venue that would seat over a thousand people everything was all, all were always booked and so we got smart and was able to um, you know secure the venue and, and now we, we try to come a, a couple times a year. But anyway, uh, Jason, what, what was going on with you? I, I understand uh, this time you, you, um, had your, uh, you had your acoustic guitar, which, you know, doesn't always happen, right? Yeah, I mean, I was, this one was exciting for me to go back and revisit because I, I almost, um, the Lord put on my heart recently, like, hey, we're, we're, going, we're getting ready to go to Dallas again. And, I'm, and it was like, hey, you have a Dallas album and you guys don't have one on the table. You, you probably should get on that. <laughs> and so I, I, I pulled it out and started started mixing it to, and, and the Lord really put it on my heart to make sure that that's ready for that Dallas Spirit School coming up. Right. And when I when I was listening to it, I was reminded that that was a, that was the only time that I've so far that I've <laughs> brought out the acoustic guitar in the in the middle of what we were doing. And I remember just how much fun it was, like how much how much I really enjoyed it because uh, it you know, back in the early days, I like, I always played electric and then I, you know, I played acoustic for a long time to kind of support everybody, you know? And so I kind of took a back seat off the electric for a while and I missed, I missed the electric so much. <laughs> but I used to complain, you know, I would complain about like, oh, I'm playing acoustic all the time. I really miss playing electric and I'm playing electric all the time. And I'm like, you know what? I kind of miss playing acoustic sometimes. <laughs> and it was one of those moments <laughs> where I got to like do that. And it really just, it really, it, it blessed me like mixing it. You know, in there listening to it and, and like going back into that and just like feeling the presence of God on it and the, the breath of God on it. All I could say is, is God loves Dallas, Texas. Yeah. So the, the anointing was there. Um, like I, we were talking about healing, uh, mentioned healing. Um, and I, I was listening to uh, Brittany sing and you could just feel the waves of like it was just like waves of healing. Yeah. You know, just the, the portion we listened to. Yeah. So what was going on with yeah. you? Do you remember anything about that? Because I, I only remember that when we were listening back to it, like the reassurance of the faithfulness of the Lord, like you could just yeah. feel he was reassuring his sons and his daughters. And he was just bringing this like healing and this peace and this calm of his love just to wash over all of us in that moment. And now for generations to come, because yeah. it's just going to continue. Yeah. But just, I felt that like the father's heart to reassure us of his faithfulness in every moment. That's really good. Caesar. Um, do you remember Dallas and, you know, you, you're, uh, you were telling us yeah, something happened there real special. Yeah. And Dallas is kind of where the Lord delivered me from being so self-conscious. And I actually just remembered, I felt the love of the father so, so much in Dallas. Yeah. Wow. You know, I felt at his heart that, you know, he loves us and he wants the best for us, but you know, we just got to trust him, you know, but it was in Dallas where I felt his love so much. I, I, I don't, I never really like felt his love like that before. But, like, I'm sure you guys felt it, too. I felt his heart that he wants, he loves his children, and he wants the best for them, you know? So we, we got to trust him because he sees the full picture, and sometimes we don't, you know? Most of the time we don't, but we just got to trust in him, you know, because he loves us, you know? That's he sent good. his son for us, yeah. Good. Wow, good. praise God. All right, Dr. Mike. Yes, sir. You know, um, as I was just really feeling remembering what the spirit was doing at that time and 
and you, you know, each of you were kind of hitting on that. And it's, I was feeling the same thing. It was this healing flow and it was this restoration flow. And, um, another word I want to put out about it is that I think it was just such a safe, there was a safe place, you know, to be able to heal and to be able to be restored and to be revived and renewed and all the different other words we could throw in there. Um, and you've taught this a lot is that there has to be safety. And that's what I feel on this Dallas album is that it's a safe place where you can heal. It's a safe place that you can be renewed by the Holy Spirit and you can allow the waves of restoration to come over you. And uh, that's, I think, what was happening to the people in Dallas and even in all of our lives is that as we were playing and worshiping the Lord and releasing all that, he, as we gave our worship, he was releasing mm -hmm. healing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And so I would really encourage you, if you want to have time of healing, time of renewing, where you are feeling safe and you are coming outside of the brokenness of this world and the traumas of this world, and just to have experiences with God's love and restoration, then Dallas is the right album to listen to. That's good. Well, there you have it. We are excited about this album, and we are going to offer this uh, to you. And this is uh, live. It captures that environment of that, of that environment of Dallas. Whatever it was that God needed to do came forth out of us, and that is available to you. And you play that in your home, and it's, it's a, there's a, just a healing flow there. You can feel it right away as soon as it starts. So God bless you. Hey, thanks for uh, hanging out with us. And we'll see you on the next new album. Bye-bye.